I don't know what most of you see in married men. Let me tell you something. Married men is an expired product. Same goes to married women. Married men, married me women, they are expired products. Okay? And to you married men, keep your distance on one side. To you single lady that wants a married man, what do you want from that married man? And the funniest part of this is that most of this majority of these married men, their wives are so beautiful, even after having how many kids for them. Just look at this lady sitting beside this man. Just look at that. See, guys, <laughs> news reaching us is that Shamsi is dating a married man. That a married man is the one sponsoring this um, expensive lifestyle you are seeing because a few days ago she traveled and i think she is still you know where she went to now for nash don't open for you anyways watch the video to the very end because as you all know people must surely talk okay the cutest kimmy was like shamsi is dating someone husband them say the guy in a married man oh <laughs> how sister shama got the post person husband now like how how do you guys do that someone's um a uh, uh, husband you guys know that the wife will always be praying for the side chick to die side chick something will happen to you side chick this one side chick that one will not go see the dead married men will not know say the tears of that woman go come to pass whatever she says whatever cause she lays on you my dear it must surely come to pass so why now are you going to a married man? Why don't you also for yourself? Keep yourself. See, I don't just understand. Tando says, funny thing is that I don't see them competing with other winners. They are not fighting with Messi or Fina or the female winners. No, their focus is Blue Ava. Like, because of a man? Mm. I am embarrassed on their behalf. Okay, this one is not even about Shamsi or whatever. This one a competition now competing competing who is uh, the winner who did not win why so much competition ever since kosi arrived in nigeria people are seeing one or two things don't worry by god's grace on the 19th she's leaving nigeria for you guys to shop nigeria because what's all this ever since she won the show you guys do not want to rest competition 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 it's either you guys are body shaming or you guys are saying oh she's not signing and no brand is signing her why must ah oh if she wears anything you guys will be like oh any car she drives you guys will be like na 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 boyfriend na sugar daddy the sponsor while well, i'll be like bicycle let's keep on going so you see now shamsi is trending on twitter na baba team they, they use trend or they trend you anyhow like make you put some which is not even good shamsi well, I'm sure you're not even going to come out to say anything about what's going on and all of that. But baby girl, I just hope and pray what is trending right now is not true. But, you know, the tattoo hands, you were the one that posted it. This one said, I remember when Shanzi told Fina that she can never be a second option. And they also criticized her for dating a man that was clearly not in a relationship. Laughing out loud, one can never imagine she is dating a married man or more. Married man, married man, married man, na expired products. Married man don't expire. There's nothing good we come out of a married man as a single lady. You're dating a married man. There's nothing good we come out of that married man. The only thing that you will experience if you are dating a married man is pain. Because let me tell you, the married man will not give you the attention, the full attention you need. I know you will say, oh, married men, they are giving money, my dear. Go and sit down. Married man, the money where married man go give you, go shop, I go finish. Let's keep on going. The guy might just be her cousin. You guys are judging Shamsi too fast. Think about it. They actually look alike. <laughs> hey, Abby. Very soon now, Shamsi will be trending on Insta blog, uh, Linda Ikeji, Yaba Left, Gossip Mio. Um, Tunde did not know they post this kind of thing, Shao, but it can't be like Tunde they post, but in Tunde they two post and like that. But, 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 but. Shamsi, 
ah, God, I don't just know this is bad. Shamsi should have known that you can't hide your illegal worker for too long. You must be caught red-handed. She should have learned from Shukura, the mm, and others. What a shame. A fine girl like that reducing herself to being a and husband. <clears throat> Oh, mom, make on day, make on take a miss with all these vulgar, vulgar ways on the right. <laughs> but then again, come to think of it, what if all these things now false? Hmm? What if? What if? What if? But uh, see me like this. Uh, I cannot serve anybody. I won't say, oh, this person is not doing it. That person is not doing it. Everybody get their own for their body. Everybody has a secret. But my own is that. See, leave married people alone. When I go just the form on holy saints, make fin a mess now. The whole Twitter go catch fire. I be he get any fan base where they support. What us to defend Fina? Well, no, no, it's Chamsy era. Let the drag begins, my dear everybody. <laughs> It go reach everybody last last. In fact, the uh, reunion is coming. I'm sure this dragon, everything is going to get to everybody when reunion starts. So sham sham, maybe now your time be this, okay? But married man, it's a no no for me. It's a no no, darling, okay? Because of what you're hurting and your fellow woman. That's just it. It's a big no for me. Maybe Niger girls keep disgracing uh, themselves from. Mercy to Maria, from Maria to Beauty, from Beauty to Shamsi, snitching another woman's husband, breaking peaceful homes. That's it. That's it. The man will go home and be scolding the wife. The man will go home and be comparing the wife with you. The man will go home and be, you know, hitting the wife. All these kind of things is what I hate the most. Even Niger girls leave married men alone, allowed married men enjoy their marriage. Karma is real. My dear, you see this K-A-R-M-A, it's 100% real. You go reach everybody. You see, um, karma is real. Forget to, forget to leave married men alone. You are scattering homes. Even Niger, please, I'm not defending, mm -hmm, but no man that wants to stay can be snatched. Let's just leave Shamsi alone. See? Yeah. But then again, why did Shamsi uh, allow the man to, you know, date her or whatever? And the man as well, the both of them are to be blamed. The, you know, say, you know, say all these things were there for their leg. Eh? Ah, the two worker. Shamsi is to be blamed for allowing the married man to do whatever. The man is also to be blamed. Most of these girls dragging Shamsi for you know doing it with a married man or sleeps with married men in the in the in reality because what the FECK does these married men mm -hmm, with if every girl on social media are against it hypocrisy hypocrisy is real on social media in fact where you see hypocrisy is on social media because that thing most of these people are against is what they do the most behind closed doors. That is what they do the most behind closed doors. But all I'm saying right here is that leave, avoid. If a married man stops you, my dear, take your slippers, carry your koi koi, carry your whatever it is you're wearing. If I throw them away, run for 40. Because, <laughs> because, now just here, I go stop them. Let's keep on going. Someone was like, I said it here that Shamsi is not a smart lady, unnecessary show off and seeking attention to Pepe. Who? If you want to flirt around with another woman's husband and shop money, have common sense. Shamsi is just a disgrace. This is the bad name they always put on Bibi Niger girls. Exactly. Now, the people that are hustling for the money, the people that are hustling for themselves, they would tag them, they would tag it, um, sugar dad. Even the ones who work hard and clean for their money, society would put all in one box. That is what I'm saying. And tag them husbands, natural slash wrong girls. This is definitely a setback for BB Niger girls. Exactly. Because they would say, oh, what do they know? Uh, maybe you buy a car now, you buy a house. They would say, is sugar this, is sugar that, is this, is that we are doing? Ah, kilo day, kilo day, kilo shelle. Yoruba people, upset, I pronounce her very well. It's not good. It's bad. 
it's bad right now when the woman sees it now the woman will just be there crying while of a person where they cry because of man <laughs> see i make i tell you if you be married woman and you they cry because of man see if i get you eh and if i get you just clean your eyes if you see food shop if you see money buy clothes wear take yourself out and enjoy yourself darling okay thank you so much bye <laughs>